boy, we got a good video for you guys today. We are going to be putting decals on my four-wheeler. As you saw in the previous couple of videos from my four-wheeler, I repainted it. So we'll be putting some decals on there. So I got a drawer full of Big Bear and Yamaha stickers. So we'll be throwing those on, on it to make it look like a proper Yamaha. So with that being said, we got the stickers ready. I just washed up the four wheeler outside off camera and we're gonna have to pull the old sportsman outside so we can pull the old big bear inside. Let's get into it. So we got the four wheeler inside and while well, it kind of air dries, I'll give you a quick little run through on what stickers we got. So we have the tank decals, which will be going right there. And then we got the classic Yamaha emblem. We got a couple of those. Uh, big and small and we have some like smaller word printed of Yamaha some bigger word printed of Yamaha and we have two strips that say Big Bear I'll be going on the rear fender just like that so that being said I'm thinking we should get sticky with it not like that but you know what I'm saying. Let's start throwing on this side's decal, uh, the, the left side's decals, which for you it might be right, I'm not sure. Um, but anyway, let's hop in it and see how it looks. done with the first side this thing is looking good the red accents are making the four-wheeler really come together I mean you know it doesn't really make sense with the seat cover and then this but I mean what do you do because I mean when I originally bought the four-wheeler there was already a half ripped like big bear thing on like the uh, fender so that's technically where big bear should be and then I put the little Yamaha logo down there because it says 350 on the tank, which the tank decal looks amazing on there. Because, I mean, a lot of people were telling me, oh, it's not going to pop out because of the black font or whatever. But it, it pops pretty good because it's got the gray outline on it. And then where the uh, warning labels were in the tank, I put the Yamaha there and then the big Yamaha emblem which it doesn't look horrible but I think I think it makes it look good makes it come together as a four-wheeler so now I think we could move on to the front of the machine so now we can put um I think the other big Yamaha logo right there and then one of the little Yamahas right there or something or I don't know we'll figure it out because I mean I do have that on there which whatever so I think we're gonna actually do that and then down there 
where the diff guard is or skid plate, I'm gonna put Yamaha. So then you got that in the front. So let's get into that right now. Never packed my bags because of you But if you'd asked, I'd have never moved to a town No one cares, Kiffin's winning I admit it, well I still do So I'm a poor Okay, so now that we got the front done We got the big Yamaha emblem, Yamaha lettering That <laughs> Which, I mean, it kind of doesn't really make a whole bunch of sense, but I mean, it gets covered up by the rack most of the time, which whatever. And then we got Life Art Open, Seaboard's TV, you know, whatever. And you get on there, or it's used to say torque uh, diff controller lock or whatever. Now it says Yamaha, which looks pretty cool. Pretty cool. So now. We get to work on the My World left. Yeah, you'll be seeing right side. And then we'll be able to move to the rear and put, I think I'm just gonna put one decal or something. I don't know. I might put like a little Yamaha or something on the back, but let's get into it. From Mississippi where I found a broken heart And I brought it with me cause you, you never really came to shake a memory I'm doing life alone's getting kinda tricky If I drove back home not a soul would miss me And the, the light at the end's getting hard to see Cause the way it is ain't ever what it seems Okay, so for this side, with the Big Bear deal, see, I don't know why, but this side has like a matte kind of like roughness to it. And that side doesn't. So it wasn't wanting to really stick. So now I got weights on it to maybe help with that. But otherwise, and we got the other tank decal on and then the other like side deal on. So we're gonna let that sit for maybe a half an hour or so. We'll come back to that for peeling. And now, move all the sticker garbage away. We're gonna move on to the backside. But if anybody has I'm keep that shit between me and Tennessee. I put the living room up in smoke and drive a quarter mile up. Okay, so now that we got them stickers on, we got Yamaha next to C-Boys, and we got the logo next to C-Boys. So I think we got the back done and from the lower angle. And then I'm going to wait to do peel off this sticker for now. Um, but I think I'll put Yamaha stickers on my helmets I'll put the rest of them on helmet so let's do that right now the road to the big store on 17 the skins in the end a fake ID while he's standing there all right so this actually turned out pretty good also yo yo helmet you know don't cover up that DOT sticker yeah, she looks pretty good from the back. Like that. Looks like a Yamaha helmet. Now we got one more helmet to do that to. I gotta go get that, so I'll be back in a second. Skin me if I got some Friday night place to be. But it's just me. Uh, she's pretty hot. Um, so we got that one on there. And then, yep, and then we got the other one with the gloss and then the mat. Gloss, mat. And then, you know, we got this sucker. Hopefully, I'm gonna put, you know, moments away. 
I gotta get a GoPro mount on this one yet for riding. Cause I think I'm gonna wear this one when we do our trail riding thing. We do it once a year, grouse hunting trips, you know. I'll pop up a picture of the thumbnail of one of our previous grouse hunting trip videos. But anyway, I think I'll be wearing this one this year instead of the one on the right. Cause the one on the right, I ended up having to wear sunglasses all the time because it was really dusty. So I think I'm going to wear that one. It might be a little bit more hot, but... Um, yeah. So I think I'll be putting a GoPro mount definitely somewhere on here. I don't know where yet. I don't think I'm going to do the top like this one. I think I'm going to try to see if I can put it right there. Maybe. Or like right off to the side or something. But anyway. This is a... We'll get back to you once we start peeling off that sticker. So I moved on out from Mississippi Where I found a broken heart and I brought it with me Cause you never really can shake a memory I'm doing life alone is getting kind of tricky If I drove back home out of soul and miss me And the light at the end's getting hard to see Side down. Um, this side really sucks. Maybe that one. A lot much harder to do. Anyway, four wheeler turned out great. So, let's get into the ending. Okay, so, um, promise y'all, promise you a later video. Maybe next week. But, God bless you. That's what I'm gonna keep first. So, we can be.